What up? What up? How are y'all doing? Me too. How about you? Doing great. All right. A bonus. So, I gotta say, if you don't know Barn Burner Restaurant, Bar you Burner. should. Yep. Oh my god. They ended up winning our contest. So, we're gonna go in. We're gonna go get some grub. Oh god. Come on. Two fat guys and food? You gotta love it. Hey, and a shout out to Foodies of Rockland, because that's, yes. that's where the contest was run. So thank you guys all, and if you're watching, I uh, uh, real appreciate to you. We're going to go check them out. Let's go. All right. Oh, Nelly, am I excited for this. So, I got the chicken and waffles. We got our chipotle sauce our crema, our honey mustard, and of course, our maple syrup. And I had to go with the tater tots. Oh my God. Here, we've got, you ready? Oh, candied bacon and jalapeno. Other words, jalapeno bacon. I cannot wait, this is gonna be so great. Hey Rob. Yeah. You ready? I'm ready. Let them know what you got. I've got my little angel halo. I've got the big pancake, which was the side. And like, do you want toast? No, I want a pancake. It's what you can get here as your side instead of toast. It's freaking cool. I got Grandma M's omelet, Denver omelet. So I'm really excited about that. And then look at what we got. Oh my goodness. This must be the dessert because this is an angel. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, this looks so good. Oh god. And then we didn't even finish there. Yeah, super producer. I'll grab that. Got this amazing pesto sandwich. Chicken pesto sandwich. Got the tater tots and everything as well. So we're gonna manja manja down and eat. And manja manja. I'm gonna interview them in a sec. So check it out. Oh my gosh, so we oh, just oh, had the most oh, amazing oh. meal. You guys just already saw it. Oh. We are here with the owners. This is really cool. They've been amazing through this whole process. The food that you already saw is incredible. There's a million other things on the menu that you can have. Okay, it's hold incredible. on. Incredible is not good. No, enough. it's the word you got to use. It's phenomenal. It's phenomenal. It's phenomenal, let me tell you. So By the way, there was an, ex an expectation that it was going to be good. Right. But we didn't expect to the level that it became. And so when we talk about food, let's just talk to the basics. The, the pancake oh, yeah. alone, you don't even need syrup. That's how yes. good it is. So the you, waffles. you're not covering anything up. Every yeah. single meal was unbelievable. So oh, phenomenal. 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 Exactly. Okay. So what did you have? I had the chicken and waffles. Oh my god. And I was an idiot. I put too much syrup on like we just right. talked about. It didn't need syrup. And it was, oh, and the chicken flair. Pesto. <laughs> oh my god. Chicken sandwich by Super Producer. I had the, the Grammy M's Denver omelet. I mean, it, and then we even got an angel food I mean, French toast that is. It came down from the heavens. Oh, oh, oh my. And it was good. So we've talked enough. We want to hear more. From our owners here. By the way, by the way, oh, yeah. this is Tiffany. Hi. And this is Gabe. Yep. Thank you guys for having yeah, us. Yeah, sure. truly. We had to oh, And if you don't know that, you need to get to know that. And say, ah! Absolutely. <laughs> so you need to come check out Barn Burner. Yes. The top, you guys made everything in here. We did, yes. Yeah. We did. Yeah. We're talking about the tables. Yep. All the stuff in the wall you painted over. You created this amazing uh, restaurant location. How long have you been open? It was uh, February 8th, 2016. Wow, so we've been open for a little while. Yeah. Nice. I remember it was the day after the Broncos won the Super Bowl. That's oh, the oh, oh, the Broncos oh, showed up. The Broncos yeah. win, he opens the restaurant. Yeah, there was a day later. <laughs> List his ticket cashed in. Yeah. Done the right place. So yeah. we, we yeah. attended, uh, we signed the lease in. July of 15, when well, we thought it was going to take like three, four weeks to open, yeah. it took like six months. Oh, wow. really stuff. Yeah. So what was the passion for you to open? What was, 
I want to hear from you. What did you, what was this thing about that you wanted to do? So, uh, I was raised in restaurants, so my parents owned restaurants when I was younger. Yeah. And I had just always worked in them. Um, I really enjoy the people, the relationships, and so um, I always worked for kind of crazy people, Gabe, what can I say? So he was like, you need to stop working for crazy people and open up your own place. So, yes. Um, my dad actually is a partner in this because he has a lot of restaurant knowledge as well. Perfect. Um, so he's uh, just a lifesaver and he helps out with Stuff that I'm not as good with, but so it kind of evens itself. So he's the crazy one, then, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> he's the crazy one. Yes. So I gotta ask these recipes because I mean everything was phenomenal. Are those your set secret, super secret, special recipes, or they are? Yeah, we um, tested and made a whole bunch of stuff before we opened. Yeah. Come on. But then just experimenting and coming up with what flavors go with what. And she's Michelin trained. No, I'm just <laughs> That's how good the food looks. The food is that good. But on top of that, this chicken and waffle is a special. That really hasn't left the special. Right. In like 10 months, it's a permanent yeah. special. Yeah. And so yeah. I like it. it's going to be around. I think it's going to be around. People tend to really love it. Yeah. So yeah. you have that. This, well, I don't even know where to go. This is so good because I'm so happy. Real quick. <laughs> we did a survey on food. Yes. Yes. Oh. Rockland or Roseville. So I wanted to know what, or we wanted to know, excuse me, what the number one Moms and Pops restaurant cafe was. The first day, I'll be honest, they didn't have very many votes. And then all of a sudden, somebody was like, hey, wait a minute, time out here. You know, I like to say that. The second day we put it out, they came out like a and then the third day that we did the voting, they overwhelmingly destroyed the whole poll survey. And I'll tell you what, the comments that we got and saw from people, you are all correct. Yes. Vid, the food is, I know we're harping on the food a lot, but it was phenomenal. Not only that, but the service, oh my God, what great people the you got to come down here. you got to meet them. you got to say what up and go from there. Am I right or am I wrong? Yeah, and then I just want to say thank you to everybody that did vote for us. All our customers is what makes our business what it is and it makes it enjoyable and everything. So thank you. Yeah. Well, first of all, we got to thank the chef back there. Yes. Um, thank you, guys. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate you for doing everything so much. <laughs> appreciate everything that you guys did. And... You know what? I'm, I'm going to throw something out there. Throw it. I, you, I oh, those guys in Bolo, they, they never know what I'm doing. This was so good that uh, so whoever watching this or is on Foodies, yes, um, we're going to get, we're going to pay for, um, for two people to come right. down to Harvard. Right. So yeah. we're going to run that now, and yeah. we're going to, your customers are so great uh, that we want to give back, and we want to give back to that allow us to come to a show, and we want to get back to you. That's what we're about. We're about giving back to the community, so we're gonna okay. send you some people. Okay, oh, thank you. Sound great? Yeah. Is there? Oh, I gotta bring this up because we just talked about it. You gotta eat the flowers. Oh, 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 this whole thing happened. It had another wonderful baby, ten months old. So we want to congratulate you on both of you on that, and uh, have to, and able to get a little time. But you got to keep this thing going. You just keep going, oh, yeah. keep it going with the community. This is the next part. This is what we were trying to stall for. The flowers here are edible. Edible. So I've never actually eaten a flower before, but she tasted a whole. You guys tasted a bunch of different yeah. flowers. No, I'm not waiting. And these are the best. Yes. I tell I tell people it tastes about like what you expect a flower to taste like. Okay. It'll <laughs> work. Not bad. It's sour. Yeah. yeah. It's, that's what. Oh yeah. It's like how it was. Yeah. Well, I wanted to do the little. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's the thing you want to do. It's got to be more. <laughs> not oh <all> god. <laughs> Well, oh, thank you again for watching. What up? Thank you for thank you joining us on the show with Barber. You have to get here. Yes, you have to come down here and now. Somebody's winning now. Breakfast, lunch, or two.
Yes. Two. Come in, and anybody who else, come in, tell them you saw what up. Let them know that the community is here to support you, and you have to solve it. Awesome. Okay. Appreciate right. it. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Yeah. All right. All right. What up? What up? What up? <laughs> yeah, that 